Don't Spit It Out, A Wine School Dropout's Guide to Thriving at the Wine Store by Tanisha Townsend. Introduction. What can you use this guide for? I want you to try something real quick. Open up Google, YouTube, or TikTok, whichever you prefer, and search for how to enjoy wine. What do you find? If your results are similar to mine at all, it's probably article after article or video after video with titles like how to drink wine properly, how to drink wine like an expert, like a pro, like you know what you're doing. And while a lot of those articles do offer good tips, I want to gently push back on the emphasis of doing it the right way. We're wine school dropouts after all. Now, don't get me wrong. Again, there are reasons behind a lot of the steps mentioned in articles like these, but don't mistake any of these guides as a strict to-do list. What's funny is that most of these lists of steps to enjoy wine will usually end with something like, ultimately, wine tasting is a personal journey, so do what you enjoy. I find that funny because, first of all, duh, but that statement can sometimes feel like a cop-out too. Almost like saying, thanks for reading, but you shouldn't have. For someone with little to no knowledge of wine yet, and whose wine journey is just beginning, that idea of total freedom can be just as intimidating as an absolute list of things you must do to enjoy wine, quote, the right way. I find that most of these guides don't really offer that missing step between learning the basics of wine tasting and fully developing your own taste and preferences. That's where I come in. My name is Tanisha Townsend, and welcome to Don't Spit It Out, a Wine School Dropout's Guide to Thriving at the Wine Store. I'm an American who moved from Chicago to Paris several years ago. While I knew a bit about wine, I didn't speak French when I arrived. And now, here I am, living a life of wine tastings, conferences, and tours, and speaking a little French as well. After all my years of experience, I believe that the absolute best way to achieve an honest encounter with wine tasting that will satisfy your own curiosity is with actual one-on-one -on -one time with a wine expert. Now, the idea of a wine expert can be intimidating for some, and we'll talk about them more a little bit later. But you should know that most wine experts genuinely want you to enjoy wine. That means that you may enjoy different wines, even dislike wines that they love. So in this guide, you will listen to the first few episodes of my podcast, Wine School Dropout, produced by Studio Ochenta, where we'll go over some of the fundamentals of wine. And this is more than just a how to drink wine guide. It's more of an exploration of wine as a whole its history, the science behind its fermentation, the basic vocabulary behind describing wine, and the question most of us want the answer to, is a $200 bottle really better than a $20 one? At the end of each episode, I'll walk you through additional information on each topic, mostly from conversations I've held with other wine experts from all parts of the industry, winemakers, wine retailers, sommeliers, and much more. I sincerely hope that after listening to this audiobook, you will learn what I think is the most crucial skill to develop a taste for wine, finding the right method to discover what you enjoy. So that when you get to the wine store, you can look at that wine you've been craving for a while and say, tonight, I want you. In fact, in this first episode, we'll start by emphasizing something I truly live by. Wine is for all. <laughs>